Beep, beep, everybody. Hope you're all having a great day. Thanks so much for tuning into the channel. Uh, this is going to be the first in a series of videos uh, featuring eBay mystery packs, mystery packs that I bought with my own money off of eBay. Um, I think I have a total of four of them, but I will probably seek out more down the road. This will be an irregular series. It'll I'll just post videos whenever I'm in the mood for, for doing stuff like this. Uh, I think there's a big truck driving down the road, so my apologies for that. Beep, beep. So what we have today is called Tuesdays with Dad. Um... Where did I put that? <laughs> These are what they look like. Um, if you can scan that QR code, it will take you to the uh, the maker of these eBay page. But I have written down some things. Um, the eBay number uh, as of March 21st, 2023 is 3255-3255. 6681-9743. These are $25 plus free shipping, and they are discounted when you buy more than one. Uh, let's start digging into them and see what we find. Uh, I have seen these on other eBay channels that fit feature mystery packs, and uh, they were mostly pretty good, I thought. And I usually buy two at a time when I when I get these uh, they, to get a better sampling of them. We have two very large team bags here. And let's see what we might find in, in here. Okay, Alfonso Soriano from Donra Studio 2004. Now that's a set I have never seen anything from. Let me move this one out of the way so there's some room here. Uh, I got two stands up already just in case we find something neat. And if you're curious, that's what the backs of those look like. Uh, 2022 Donruss Ichi. I think that's a name variation. Here's a Donruss Optic Mike Trout from the Bomb Squad insert set. We have a Carl Crawford um, rookie card, possibly, upper deck. Um, 2003. I don't know if that's his rookie card or not. I was not collecting at that time. So you can uh, leave a note in the comments. Uh, Trey Turner from the Rookies, and I thought that is an insert set for 2016 Donruss. So that's a nice one, Trey Turner rookie card. We have a Wander Franco rookie card from Top Series 1 of 2022. Oh, actually, this is a update. Update. It's a rookie debut card. I'm sorry. Uh, 1973 Major League Baseball All-Star Game Highlights. Joe Morgan, this is from Topps Heritage. Uh, that's from 2022. And all the 2022 Topps Heritage boxes I opened up, I never never pulled a highlights card. <laughs> JJ, blah, 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 pardon me, JJ Blade rookie card from 2023 Topps Series 1. <laughs> I didn't recognize that even though I had opened 2023, um, uh, I guess about a month ago. We have a Donruss Optic Paul, Col Paul Goldschmidt Splash Insert card. A 2021 Topps Allen & Ginter Chrome Rod Carew. That's a nice one. I'm a big fan of Rod Carew, so it's nice finding Rod Carew cards in mystery packs. Um... Logan Gilbert, 2022 Topps Chrome. Forget what this is. What this parallel is called. Um, I don't know. I, the ring is not. The name is not ringing a bell. But that is one of the uh, parallels. We'll just call it Sparkly Parallel. <laughs> A Stadium Club Power Zone, Fernando Tatis Jr. Uh, Tim Anderson from 2022 Topps Chrome. A Trey Turner card from Select. 
numbers insert this is panini select from 2022 i don't know if we've ever opened up a 2022 select Pete Alonso from Donruss Optic from the Bomb Squad insert. We have a 2022 Allen and Ginter Shohei Otani. Uh, Bowman first. Connor, I'm not sure how to pronounce that. Prelip. Prelip. Another first Bowman for Nate Furman. We have a Bobby Witt Jr. and High Five Futures from Bowman Chrome. That's a nice card. We have uh, Topps Chrome 2022 rookie debut card for Julio Rodriguez. That's nice. Uh, Felix Valerio, first Bowman. Not sure. 2022. Not sure if that's a parallel or something else based on the coloring on it. I'm not real familiar with the Bowman product line. We have a Pete Alonso rookie performers. Uh, from 2019 tops. That's a nice one. A Gypsy Queen rookie card of Trey Turner. And this is, um, what do they call that? Um, a frame border. Blue parallel. That's really nice. I think I'm going to put that one up on the stand there. 1991 Cal Ripken franchise. Uh, Say a Suzuki rookie card from Topps Gallery. We have a 91 score Ricky Henderson. So we got a nice mix of older and newer cards. Another 91 score Master Blaster Jose Canseco. We have Topps Gallery Stan Musial. That's a nice one. Uh, Brian Reynolds. A CJ Abrams first edition from Bowman. Yu Chang uh, from Bowman Chrome, rookie card. Uh, Brandon Marsh from the Rookies from Donruss Optic. Uh, MJ Melendez, rookie card. Uh, Jay Cronenworth from Topps Chrome Future Stars. Uh, Pedro Pineda, Bowman in 3D, Bowman Chrome. And Drew Thorpe, first Bowman from Bowman Chrome. So that was a pretty good team bag, I thought. Let's see what's in the second one. This is all part of the mystery pack. These are not two mystery, separate mystery packs. And this one looks like it's probably the one that has uh, hits of some sort. So I figure out how to get it out of the bag. Those over here. We have an Aaron Judge from... 2022 Topps Allen and Ginter. That's a nice card. We have a relic, Jorge Polanco, numbered 24 out of 49. I hope uh, the glare from the light is not disturbing you. National Treasures. Uh, I'm not. I don't. This is the first time I've ever seen a National Treasures card. That's from 2022 Panini. So that's not only the first time I've ever seen one, it's a pretty nice one, too. Let me see. Uh, it's game-worn used material. That's cool. I always like the game-used ones. Oh, wow, a Reggie Jackson. Um, is this triple threads? Yeah, this is triple threads. Um, from 2021, numbered 161 out of 199. I could not tell you what the name of this parallel is. They have some unusual names uh, for the color variations in triple threads. Uh, for some reason, Onyx comes to mind, and there's some other unusual names. I could not tell you what that is, but it's definitely a nice one. I will cherish that card. Uh, rated Rookie from Donruss Optic. Uh, this must be some sort of parallel, candy cane parallel, I want to say, but I'm not sure if that's the case. That's number 23 out of 46. So if you know what the name of that parallel is, go ahead and let me know in the comments because I'm not right, really sure of it myself at the moment, but I will probably look that up at some future date. That's a nice one. 
Uh, Andre Dawson, uh, 2022 Tops Allen and Ginter Chrome. He's got a chrome up here. Uh, not sure what the color parallel name is for this. It's kind of, um, I want to say red, but it's a little bit leaning towards magenta. That's also numbered, 126 out of 199. So I will, oh, jeez. <laughs> I'm losing everything that's to the left of me. Let's move Nathan the Gnome over. And that is definitely a nice one. I really like that one. Uh, Michael Massey. This is like a green icy parallel from 2023 Top Series 1. That's a rookie card. That's number 382 out of 499. I don't know who Michael Massey is, but uh, we'll quickly look back here. Um... He has some pretty good numbers in the minors. He's a second baseman. Those are pretty decent numbers for a second baseman. We'll have to see how he does this season. Maybe this might be a nice nice card for down the road. we got a Jose Miranda rookie card from Capstone. Is that what this is? I've never opened any Capstone. Yeah, 2022 Panini Capstone. And this is an auto, Jose Miranda. Nice. Uh, we got some 2023 20, Top Series 1. That's Oswald Peraza rookie card. Uh, Jeter Downs rookie card. Uh, Lennon Sosa. This is from uh, 2022 Tops Heritage Miners. Uh, Bowman Chrome, Jose Trevino. And an Albert Pujols from Diamond Kings. Panini Diamond Kings, crowning moment, and this is a red frame parallel, so that's a nice one. Hey, I'm impressed. That's a pretty good first pack. Really enjoyed it. Let's open up the second pack and see how we do with the second one. Probably should get my uh, box cutter to open this instead of... <laughs> doing it the hard way yeah we're gonna have to do that that's a little little hard to get open so we'll open that up from the top so for $25 I think that's a pretty pretty nice deal this has got a slab in it which one is the they both have slabs in them there must be hot packs or something like it Well, I didn't didn't think of getting my 3x5 card out to cover it, so I guess we're just going to <laughs> not worry about that. We have a Now and Then from Topps Heritage. This is uh, Jacob deGrom 2019. I don't have any 2019 Topps Heritage. That's a nice one. Uh, Manny Machado from uh, Topps Holiday. Uh, doesn't look like that's any kind of parallel. Th those are so confusing for me. <laughs> oh, cool. Al Oliver from Diamond Kings. This is a gray frame parallel. That's from uh, 2017 Diamond Kings. Big fan of Al Oliver. Think Al I think Al Oliver should be in the Hall of Fame. I think he got... Screwed over with that, uh, that he, there was some collusion case where they awarded him money um, because the, uh, the owners back in uh, about the end of Al Oliver's career um, colluded to keep the um, rosters low. I don't remember the whole story, but Al Oliver could have played maybe three or four years and he would, he wanted to, and he was very close to 3000 hits. And I think that's, really horrible what happened to him and i think the hall should uh uh put him in um just to rectify that injustice um i'm definitely gonna put him like back here <laughs> i know you know the the stands are for like a sp special cards but this this one's a little personal okay jake odoritzi that's a tops chrome purple parallel um 2022 tops chrome update 
I don't have anything from that set. I didn't bother buying any of those when they came out. We have Stadium Club Power Zone, Juan Soto. Uh, Ichiro from Topps Heritage 2019. That's a nice one. Definitely love the uh, Heritage and Archives cards. We've got an O'Neill Cruz rookie card from Bowman. That's a nice one. Uh, Vladdy Guerrero on uh, uh, Panini Select. Uh, what is this? Uh, Panini Obsidian Fernando Tatish Jr. from 2022. That's Chronicles Obsidian. I'm sorry. Hard to remember most of these uh, things that uh, come from the uh, Chronicles line. Tops Allen and Ginter 2019. Roger Clemens. That's a nice one. Uh, Miguel Vargas. That is a rainbow. No. Yeah, it's a rainbow. Rainbow. Foil parallel <laughs> rookie card. Uh, Nolan Gorman rookie card. Uh, the regular Miguel Vargas rookie card. Uh, Connor Norby from uh, 2022 um, Topps Heritage Minor Leagues. Uh, ooh, Jason Morobel. I hope I pronounced that right from Bowman Chrome. Uh, Aaron Judge from Topps Heritage. The Topps News... 20 what does that say it looks like 18 i can't really tell need bifocals i'm gonna go in april to get my eyes checked it's it's the annual checkup so maybe i'll get some new bifocals and i can read these copyright dates on the back a little bit better victor robles this is like the 1984 design uh 2019 tops i don't think that's uh, no that's not an archives card that's from uh, that's an insert set from 2019 tops uh not numbered not sure uh, what the deal is with the blue parallels they might have been exclusive to some packaging but i didn't open any up when that came out because i wasn't collecting yet until the fall of 2021 here we have a 1991 upper deck juan gonzalez uh, 2021 Allen Ginner Tops Chrome Jeff Bagwell. That's a nice one. Just checking. Um, Diamond Kings from Donner's Optic 2022. Fernando Tatis Jr. Wow. Uh, K Gabriel Hughes. Uh, Panini Elite Extra Edition. Um, Relic. 156 out of 199. Don't know who Gabriel Hughes is. Um, this is game used. It says just player worn used material. So that's a nice one. I'll have to look up Gabriel Hughes and find out who he is. Uh, Jazz Chisholm Jr. Oh, I remember these. Uh, commemorative Jackie Robinson Day Patch. That's a nice one. Um, from 2022. I think this is the first one I have, have ever come across. I haven't come across these yet. Uh, we'll put that one back here. And let's open up the second. Team bag. Oh, I'm sorry. I think I called those slabs. They were just really thick. <laughs> um, top loaders. We got Joe Adele from Bowman Chrome. Um, hmm. Kumar Rocker, Bowman Chrome, Air Apparent. Never heard of that gentleman. That's from 2022. Definitely have some players here that I have to look up. I'm not real up on uh, draft picks and minor leaguers. I really need to, to fix that situation because all I'm doing is embarrassing myself on camera not knowing any of these. There's Hayden Dunhurst, first Bowman. Uh, Byron Buxton from uh, Topps Chrome. Uh, Diego Rincones from first Bowman. Nico Cavadas, first Bowman. Oh, Julio Rodriguez, rookie card from 2022 Topps Heritage. Uh don't know if that's the high number. I think it is the high number. 
think that's the high number. 700 is the card number there. Um, I have like one more stand, so I guess we'll put him over here. We have a Michael Harris, the second rookie card. That's a good one. Uh, Marty Cordova from SP Premier Prospects. That's a mouthful. Uh, that's from 1995. That's cool. I don't think I've ever seen any of those before. 91 score Ricky Henderson MVP card. We have a Hunter Green rookie card from Topps Gallery. A 91 Ken Griffey Jr. from Score. Uh, another one from Nolan Ryan. Randy Johnson from Topps Gallery. Uh, rookie performers. Uh, O'Neill Cruz. This is from Topps Heritage. I... The, all the tops heritage I opened up, I never saw one of these. So here's one right here. So that's a nice one. Blaze Jordan's first Bowman. And a Landon Sims first Bowman Chrome. It kind of looks like a wave parallel. It's also in black and white. Uh, that one is not numbered. I've never seen those before. Uh, Joe Ryan, that's a, I believe, a pink uh, Topps Chrome Parallel Rookie Card. Uh, Chris, pardon me, Chris Bubik Rookie Card from Bowman. We have a uh, Ricky Henderson from Topps Triple Threads, numbered 76 out of 299. I believe this is a purple parallel. And I sometimes get these confused with Topps Tribute because I think Topps Tribute has a similar T, but the Triple Threads one usually has this triple take on the back. And hopefully I'm accurate with that. If I'm not, please do correct me in the comments. That's a nice one. Um, run out of stands. Uh, running out of room altogether, actually. Uh, we'll just uh, put these up here on the, the table there. Uh, wow, what is this? It's numbered 415 out of 500. It is a Frank Thomas card. From uh, 2017 Donruss. It looks like it's a retro design. Not sure. It has a season stat line also. 1.217 OPS in 1994. The stat lines from Panini Donruss have always confused me. <laughs> they have so many different variations. But that is a pretty cool looking card. Definitely pleased with that. We have a Trevor Story. I don't know. I have no idea what this is called. It looks like a pink, uh, well, sparkly parallel. It's probably not called that from Topps Chrome. Uh, that one is numbered 15 out of 350. So I've been really impressed with the number of numbered cards that are in this these mystery packs. Um a uh, stadium, wow, stadium uh, club red foil auto of Logan Webb. Numbered five out of 50. Wow, that's impressive. And a Rosman Verdugo Bowman Chrome blue parallel. Numbered 108 at, out of 150. I don't know who Rosman Verdugo is, but he's probably a prospect, so I'll have to look him up and check him out. So that is um, uh, Tuesdays with Dad Mystery Pack. This is uh, the information for it as of March 21, 2023, 325566819743 on eBay. They are $25 for a single pack plus free shipping. If you buy more than one, the price is lowered, uh, I think, another $2 or so. I, I don't remember exactly what, what the discount was. Um, let me know what you think of this in the comments. Um, let me know if you've uh, bought these yourself and uh, what you found with them. There's a load of stuff here. Um, we're already 24 minutes in, so I'm probably not going to go over it. So um, uh, just to keep the video shorter. Um, I, I like this. This is really nice. Uh, I probably will buy some more of this down the road. 
um, maybe maybe next month after I get paid again, and I, I might I might buy a couple more of these. Thanks so much for watching. Uh, thank you for your support. Uh, please do subscribe and like and comment. Uh, I appreciate you taking the time to watch. Uh, if you have any feedback for this uh, mystery pack, uh, go ahead and put it in the comments and uh, let us know what you think. Hope you all enjoyed the video. Thanks so much for watching. Take care, everyone. Beep, beep.